by 9 p.m. with mostly clear skies remaining clear overnight with a chilly temperature of 48 degrees by 11 p.m. But it's not going to stop there. Get a look at our low temperatures for tonight. An overnight low of 39 in Grand Rapids and Fremont, 36 in Big Rapids, and 39 in Kalamazoo tonight. Just a little bit warmer, closer to the lakeshore. So because of this cold air, we actually, for the first time this season, have freeze warnings and frost advisories currently in place for parts of northern Michigan. The reason that we have that freeze warning in our higher elevations is simply because of that temperatures are likely to be a little bit cooler in that spot. Our high temperatures for tomorrow will only be in the lower 60s, partly cloudy skies throughout the day on Friday, a high temperature of 66 in Kalamazoo, 64 in Holland and Muskegon. Our Lake Michigan forecast shows some calmer winds throughout the day tomorrow, leading to wave heights ranging between one to three feet. So our feature track really doesn't show much throughout the rest of tonight and all day tomorrow, but we will start to see a little bit of cloud cover later in the day. By 2.30 in the afternoon, cloud cover will start to be a little bit more dense. And then by Friday night, we'll start to see that approaching system. Showers are possible early in the morning on Saturday. Our latest models show it coming in at around 5.30 in the morning and then becoming widespread throughout the day on Saturday. Very on and off rain showers by Saturday night. And then another burst of showers will be building through on Sunday. This is by around 5 to about 8 a.m. We could see additional showers along and towards the south of I-96. So as you're Gearing up for some Friday night football tomorrow will be that picture perfect Friday night football forecast. Our game of the week will be Sparta versus building at building for tomorrow. A kickoff temperature of around 63 degrees and halftime around 58. But we are expecting to have mainly dry skies. Just don't forget a jacket. You'll thank me later. Temperatures are also going to stay chilly for the next couple of days. Our upper level pattern shows that we have a big trough that's going to build in and that's what's really allowing for the cooler air to stick around. All that means is that we're mainly going to see our high temperatures in the 60s each and every day. 65 on Saturday with a chance of some showers and more of the gloomy, rainy fall leg forecast between Sunday, Monday, Tuesday and Wednesday. Temperatures are likely to stay in the upper 50s to lower 60s all week with overnight lows in the lower 50s to the 40s. Stay tuned. We'll have another look at your news and weather ahead.